Well, we have some new information tonight on this fallout from this hanging Halloween display. This is in the Emerson Heights neighborhood on our city's east side. We, you may remember we told you last night that this display finally came down, and the man who lives here is now losing his lease over it. But as our Rich Nye reports tonight, even some who wanted the hangman to come down, they believe the man should not lose his home. This was the elaborate Halloween display yesterday on Emerson Avenue just north of Michigan Street, prominently featuring a dummy hanging from a noose. Many people were outraged. The man who put it up said he never meant to offend anyone and he agreed to take it down. This is the photo that I took today. You can see the pole and the hanging dummy are gone, along with a lot of the other Halloween decorations. And the man who rents this home may be gone too. A group of protesters last night represented many in the community who associated the hanging display with the lynching of African Americans. The man who built the display said he just tries to entertain and maybe creep out his neighbors a little bit. But his landlord is terminating his lease over the hanging display. The Emerson Heights Neighborhood Association is trying to intervene. I think the landlord has the opportunity to reconsider looking at the totality of, of the tenants stay in the community. They've been a strong partner in uh, Neighborhood Crime Watch. They've served their neighbors hot dogs and hamburgers on community days. I don't think that this is an individual that meant harm. The landlord would not speak to me on camera, but he says he is embarrassed and mortified that this happened at one of his properties. Andrea? All right, Rich, thanks so much. We'll continue to follow that story.